Naturally, mature cocoa tree is able to produce about 1,000 flowers. However, about 90% of this is being lost through flower dropping due to inactivity and reduction of insect pollination agent. In 2017, Ghana Cocoa Board, upon realizing the reduction in production, decided to introduce the hand pollination method. After the introduction, cocoa trees that were producing about 30 to 40 pots can now produce over 300 pots. In most extreme cases, as observed on Gilbert and Company's farm, 879 pots have been produced. I'm so much actually because I am uh, an uh, officer not the eco school. The agri officers and pollination agents often monitor to see if we practice the hand pollination method. Over 20,000 pollinators were trained for some selected farms for the pilot program. The hand pollination method has helped us a lot and farmers as well. The training given to us has really helped. Chief Executive of Cocoa Board Joseph Wahin Edu says increase in production will make up for falling prices. Ever since we introduced hand pollination, farmers are doing 20 bucks per acre. Um, the farmer we interviewed here said he made 25 bucks. We've gone to other places, you know, almost everybody is getting 25 bucks. The price of cocoa continues to fall on the world market with a bag of the commodity selling at 475 Ghana cities. But Mr. Edu is urging farmers not to panic over the price with assurance government would continue to support cocoa farmers so they would not be affected by the price change. If the price is 475 and the farmer is getting three bucks, when you multiply, you get 1,475, 1,450 Ghana cities. Now, if you decide to reduce the price, right, it means that it's an equation. It means that you have to look at the yield. So if the price is going to go down, then the yield must go up. When the yield goes up, the farmer will not be worse off. I've indicated all what we are doing, all the interventions are aimed at making sure that the farmer does not get worse off. Meanwhile, pollinators have been encouraged to form cooperative union to help farmers and create more jobs. Mahmoud Mohamed Nuruddin's report for Joy News.